when Fuzzy Gertis does one of those icebreakers where you have to tell something about yourself that other people wouldn't know, he usually goes with the fact that he went to high school in Australia. What? Where in Australia? Adelaide, Adelaide, Australia. Any Adelaideans in the house? No. He also has been <laughs> nice. He has also been in a commercial for Microsoft that was shown exclusively in Best Buy stores. <laughs> you may recognize me from. But we've got him exclusively here at 20 by 2 to answer the question. How do you do? I started to notice a thing. Uh, my wife is a hugger. Uh, she uh, announces it. She says, I'm coming in for a hug, and she hugs it. <laughs> and uh, in our social sh circle, at least, uh, we, we meet up with another couple, uh, and uh, the women would hug, and then it is socially acceptable. The, the women would hug the men, and then the men are standing there looking at each other, <laughs> what to do. And I started to get, I felt a lot of awkward, uh, half hug handshakes that uh, somebody would go in with the handshake, somebody would go in with the hug, and we'd end up poking each other in the shoulder. And I started to tell my wife, I'm going to bring back the hearty handshake. I'm going to be the guy who reestablishes that the, the hearty handshake is the appropriate way for men to greet each other in public. And when this event came up, how do you do? I said, this finally, after after a year of talking about it, this is gonna be my stand. This is gonna be the moment where I instruct men on how to be men and perform a hearty handshake. And I began to, I made charts and graphs uh, of handshakes through history, and I uh, was plotting out how I would describe uh, the, the interactions I have with my friends, and I discovered in myself the edge cases. The motion capture artists I've been working with lately who do a wrestler bump, shoulder bump, and I've learned to do that. My friend Patrick, who greets me with a kiss on the mouth every time. My friends who I want to hug. And I discovered in myself that my desire for a hearty handshake was instead a fear of change, and it was a fear of uncertainty of edge cases. But that's what life is. It, the, the, the stable and normal is the boring, and I don't have an instruction for you because I am now searching for an instruction for myself to navigate the world without the hearty handshake. And that's it, because I'm tapering off, because I just figured this out this week. I'll give you a hug, maybe. <laughs>